think there are a number of challenges facing business services companies at the moment. Um, clearly a huge interest in outsourcing at the moment, particularly from uh, the public sector looking for uh, cost reductions and uh, improved quality of service. In addition, there's a higher level of competition with more companies trying to do more things for their clients. Uh, for example, moving into engineering services if they were previously in uh, softer services like cleaning. And finally, there's the ongoing challenge with business services around maintaining the right level and standards of quality of service across a large geographic area and different contract types. I think Internal Audit needs to take a, a fresh look at itself in this current climate. Um, there must be opportunities for Internal Audit to do things differently, uh, but within the assurance framework. What I mean by that is looking for efficiencies. Can it do things smarter? Um, a simple example might be control self-assessment, where Internal Audit can facilitate the process but uh, can leverage itself and focus on the areas that matter. In addition, there's um, increasing use of systems, and internal audit perhaps could take a, a different approach there to leverage um, activity and control that exists within the organisation. Internal audit teams are challenged by resources, budgets, and availability of, of staff, and also emerging risks. Um, some examples in the business services sector would include cybersecurity threats, clearly vital for uh, companies to maintain and manage the risks around exposure to customer data. Um, social media is a big factor for them as well. Uh, a bad contract can, can rapidly uh, cause huge reputational damage for a company if it gets out into the, uh, the social networks. And finally, the, um, the challenges of managing contracts. Um, the uh, risks of fraud are increasing at the present time. And there's a number of techniques that internal audit and approaches that audit can use to, to help address those. I think it's really important for Internal Audit to have a um, strong view of the assurance framework for the organisation. That means understanding who the other providers of assurance are in the, in the business, particularly operational assurance where a lot of uh, management activity will be focused. In addition, Audit needs to be flexible in meeting the needs for assurance. That might mean um, recruiting special skills to deal with some of the emerging risks I mentioned like cyber security or having in-house capability around uh, data analytics to allow them to look for symptoms of control weaknesses or fraud. I've always regarded internal audit as uh, being a, a service to the organisation that needs to make a positive impact. For business services that means being flexible and responsive to the organisation's needs.